Sushmita. I'm Sam. Broadcasting live from Global TV Bollywood Studio, India. Live from Global TV London Studio. You are watching Global TV Philippines. I'm so excited to join you. Catch me soon on the Rapporteur News with, with Isabel, Isabel Fernandez, Fernandez and, and Chino Hansen-Pilian. Hansen Together, let's unite the universe with substance by bringing news you can trust. Until then. See you. Once again, this is PJ and I'm Greg Superhero. What's happening? What's up? Guys, I'm back. You know, uh, again, first and foremost, ang gagaling ng mga singers natin kanina. You know, very, very talented. Saluto po kami sa inyo sa mga singers and uh, talented artists a while ago. Okay, so, ito na. Ito yung ating inabangan din. No? So, right now, guys, it's, again, my honor and privilege uh, to introduce today our very special guests you know uh when i saw uh, a video of, of him you know uh dressed as this very scary character in the cinemas you know scaring and pranking people it's like oh my gosh he's the best uh, ever uh pennywise you know it's a pennywise but i'm also it's a screening of pennywise of, of it chapter one chapter two so man he's really good you know when when he's uh was playing uh this uh, very uh iconic uh horror movie characters no? and especially it's also cosplaying as uh, superheroes you know like uh, beast we also have beast from uh, the dark phoenix x-men and also uh, as uh, shazam from shazam well i think it's what i ladies and gentlemen i'd like to uh, introduce to you today he is a professional events host actor model and of course a fellow puppet creator like me ladies and gentlemen the Prince of Transformation himself, Mr. Prince de Guzman. Yes. Hey. Hello, Sir Prince. What an energetic Hello, Sir. afternoon. Thank you so much uh, for having me. I'm so honored You're to welcome. be here. I'm so welcome, excited. <laughs> <laughs> you know, man, I know you guys miss being in a convention. So this yeah. is really refreshing. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for having me. You're welcome, sir. Nice to, for you to join us today, this afternoon, Sir Prince. And by the way, sir, before we start, how are you with this pandemic right now? Okay. Actually, uh, we are coping. We are adjusting to this new normal. It's becoming the better normal, as you said, yeah. right? Uh yeah. Actually, ano din, um, this is one, this is one uh, really challenging moment. But to us artists, cosplayers, and geeks, uh, maraming opportunity to explore. And all we have to do is to adjust ourselves to this way of life. Kasi kung magpapa... Kung magpapa-apekto tayo with this pandemic, I mean, malungkot na yung nangyari. So, all we have to do is to make ourselves, you know, happy as much as we can and cling to our geek yeah. our geek, geek fandoms. <laughs> yan. <laughs> yun yung mga yeah. things sa atin ngayon. So, yun yung ano, dun ko siya nilalabas. Alright. That's nice. That's very good. Uh, sir, please, mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Alright. So, yes, sir. Uh, we can start anytime right now. We'll be okay. sharing again. 
Uh, for those who are watching right now, our topic today will be discussed by Sir Prince is how to prevent creative blockage. Yes, how to prevent creative blockage. Actually, uh, ito yung pinaka, this is one of the most challenging experience that I had during the pandemic. Of course, everyone is in shock. We didn't expect this to happen. I mean, sino nga naman mag-expect? Imagine malls are, you need, you need to have a pass to enter a mall. You need yes. to stay at home for 24 hours, di ba? And you have to do meetings like this. <laughs> Nobody <Yeah>. expected <laughs> na magiging ganito ang new normal. So uh, as an artist, it caused stress and confusion, which resulted to creative block or creative blockage. So today I'm going to talk about that. I'm going to share my experience because I think we have viewers right now who are artists and cosplayers as well who might be experiencing this, all right? <laughs> okay, so first, I want to introduce myself. My name is Prince de Guzman. I am a content creator. And let's move to the next slide. I'm going to show you my logo, which I'm very proud of. Yeah, oh, I, I am a content creator and my channel is Prince de Guzman Transformation. So right now that's what I'm very busy with, <laughs> doing contents. So my content is all about horror, uh, horror movies and uh, pop culture and of course cosplay yeah most of my characters are ho in horror movies but sometimes i do superheroes just like what you said and thank you so much for watching my videos <laughs> oh, no, <sorry. laughs> later i'm going to show it to you guys so uh, next slide please there you go next slide please uh -huh. <laughs> So Prince de Guzman Transformations was created uh, in 2017 and my content is all about horror, cosplay, pop culture skits. So I also do skits, I also do acting and my former multi-channel network is ABS-CBN Adobe Studios but unfortunately we know what happened. So right now I'm already with Casting Asia and right now I have 761,000 subscribers. Yay! Hey. Oh, <laughs> Road to me. Yeah. Go to one million. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, this is what I manage ko as an artist and as a content creator. And the thing about content creators, I know you will agree to this. We are our own, alam mo yun, uh, producer, director. Yeah. Tayo na rin ang host. Tayo na rin ang artista, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, talaga malaki yung involved ng uh, pagiging creative into content creation. And as a cosplayer, here are my works. Yeah, next slide, please. These are my recent, is my oh, is Pitten and Pennywise. There you go. These are my contents. And if you want to see more of my works, uh, next slide, please. Yeah. Also, you can check it out in my channel. Yeah. So I did. Yeah. Ang hindi lang yata horror dito is Hellboy and Gellert Grindelwald from Fantastic Beasts. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> yeah. All right. Next slide. Also, uh, I'm also into pop culture, so I also cover events. So I covered uh, the Aquaman event, the Aquaman oh, in Manila. Wow. Yeah. Actually, yeah. that time I, I was after to James Wan kasi siya ang director ng Conjuring. So fun na fun ako. Imagine everyone is screaming uh, Jason and Amber and I'm the only one screaming so hard, James! <laughs> <laughs> kasi siya ang director ng Conjuring Universe and I also covered the uh, press junket of The Grudge in Malaysia. So that's oh, the yeah. godmother of horror. Celine yeah. Shea and the director of The Grudge, si Nicholas Pesh. So I interviewed them in Malaysia. These are just some of my contents. Next slide, please. And also, the latest natin is The Witcher in Manila. Oh, yeah. Witcher wow. gamers. Mga gamers. <laughs> I, I, I think this will excite you. And uh, I, we met Henry Cavill here for, uh, because we work for Netflix. So yun din, isa yun sa mga partner. Yeah. Also, I my may mga side professions ako, like acting. Yeah. Next slide, please. Yeah. Hosting, hosting. Yeah. Yung isa dyan is a toy con. Uh, I interviewed si si Stephen Ogg and Michael Kudlitz from Walking Dead, yeah. from The Walking yeah. Dead. Yeah. So I did hosting and acting. Yeah. Next slide. There you go. Yeah. Share ko lang. And why did I share this to you? Yeah. I, sana na introduce ko na maayos sa sarili ko. And I shared these because next slide. This pandemic stopped me from doing most of this. <laughs> so imagine uh, I've been doing this for years. This that is my normal. That is my normal. Then all of a sudden, in a matter of two months, it was snatched away from me. So I was confused. Siyempre, I don't know what to do. Diba? Saan ako, saan ako pupunta? And I, alam ko, 
kahit hindi into artist world, kahit, hin, hin, kahit hindi sila into the creative side, they were very confused. I don't have a work anymore. Where should I work? How should I earn money? Of course, with that, I became very anxious because I all I all I all I did was worry the first two months, and of course, we got depressed. Because you feel stuck. You're not moving anymore. Yun. So next slide. Uh, until na develop your creative block. So a creative block is, you know, it's a barrier to inspiration, can be described as inability to access one's internal creativity. Alam mo yun, hindi na pumapasok eh. You were an artist before. I mean, if someone gives you an idea, it will be very fast for you to produce something. Like for example, ako, uh, when you ask me about my content and my plan for the next three years, I can answer you straight. Now, this is my plan. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. But I can't I can't do that anymore because first public appearances were removed and as I as I showed you earlier uh, public appearance is yung pinaka niche ng channel ko. Yeah. So dun pa lang ang dami ng planong that I can move ano I can pursue. Diba? So writers, musicians and performer artists are often more likely to be affected by creative blocks. So hindi lang as a content creator so, marami dyan mga writers or kahit mga crafter. Siyempre, uh, yung mga crafter natin sa cosplay, they are greatly affected because wala nang convention. So, wala nang magpapagawa masyado ng costumes. It affects their, alam mo yun, yung earnings din nila. That's so, true. it can last for days, weeks, months, sometimes even years. Yeah. Y- yun yung na-develop sa akin, creative block. And after that, I feel stuck. Uh, hindi ako nakapag-move actually. I just uploaded a new video last week, pero natigil ako for three months. And that never happened. Kasi ang pinaka, ang lo- the longest that I didn't upload a video in my channel is one week, two weeks. But ito, three months. So grabe, it, was, it cost me a lot of anxiety. So today we're going to talk about how, how to over- overcome creative block, this pandemic. Yeah, medyo kinostomize ko siya into pandemic kasi usually kapag ka tinanong ako how to prevent creative block, ang sagot, ah, travel ka, di ba? <laughs> yeah. Of course, I can do that right now. <laughs> yeah. But more ka. Oh, of course, you can do that right now. So, kinostom ko ng konti. How to overcome creative block this pandemic. So, first thing I did was take a break. You, know, you have a me time, do not entertain more stress. Kasi it's very stressful. Sobra na yung stress, I mean, with what's happening in our society, with what's happening with our economy, sobrang sobrang stress na. So, wag mo nang dagdagan kasi the more you are pushing yourself to produce something, tapos wala ka naman talagang ma-produce, mas mas stress ka lang. And yun yung nangyari sa akin. Actually, it's very hard to overcome. So, what I did was take a break. I played a game. I played games. Actually, hindi ako bumili ng gaming console sa sarili ko until no pandemic i bought a nintendo switch <laughs> i bought a nintendo switch para lang maglaro and to take a break and social media break muna then naturally you know ideas flow as time goes by ayan so now yun yung una mong gagawin take a break wag mong pilitin kasi it will just cause too much stress okay next slide please then while you're taking a break you welcome new ideas so uh, after the pandemic, of course, we can't go out. And that's when I explored green screen. That's when I explored live streaming. That's when I explored uh, game streaming. Mm-hmm. I, I, wasn't do, I wasn't doing that before. So ngayon ko lang siya naisip, ah, pwede pala. Pwede pala ako mag-game into costume. Baka pwede kong i-share yung craft ko online. Maybe I can film this. So isipin mo lang muna. Yeah. Think innovative ideas that you have not explored before. Kasi hindi mo alam that idea pala, yung, gusto, yung, dapat mong, yung naisip mong gawin na yun, yun na pala yung makakapag-boost ng una, if you have a channel, or yun na pala yung makakapag-boost sa'yo ng new audience. Diba? Create something. Or kung hindi ka man content creator, mamalay mo, baka mahalin mo yung ginagawa mo. It will be a good avenue for you to exercise then yung alam mo yun, a healthy mind diba it's a new hobby pala sa and it will greatly affect you 
Okay, number three naman is make journaling a habit. Ito lagi ko tong sinishare sa lahat, sa lahat ng content creator. Uh, I have here two notebooks. Sorry, maaabot ba natin yung notebook? Ayun, habang sa ito. I have two notebooks. It's my book of learning <laughs> and my book of plans. So, sinusulat ko yan lahat. I've been doing this. I, I'm doing this for years na. Uh, it, it is very effective kasi, mabawa, naliligo ka. Kahit naliligo ka eh, or for example, you're eating breakfast, may nagpo-flow na idea eh. Hmm. And ang, ang, ang ugali ko, I have to write it down. Kasi makakalimutan at makakalimutan. O kaya nga sabi ko dito eh, you will for, trust me, you will forget it. <laughs> diba? Kasi that time, I'm sure you're stressed. You're under a creative block eh. So stress ka, so may pumapasok ng idea. Kasi you took a break, alam mo yun, mas klaro na yung isip mo. Write it down on a journal. Ito yung aking ano, book of Ito yung aking book of ano, book of learning. Ay, ito pala, yung Slytherin notebook ko because I love Harry Potter so much. <laughs> I'm a Potterhead. And si Hedwig yung aking book of plans. Yan. So sinusulat ko dyan lahat. So alam mo yun, kahit pangarap lang, kahit parang ang imposible siya gawin, i-push through, write it down. Kasi malay mo, one day that idea will be possible for you. It will be very possible. Okay, next. Number four is, I talk to fellow artists. Uh, I felt alone during this pandemic. And kaya din siguro hindi ako makakreate. And I felt that I was left behind kasi hindi na ako nakakagawa. Alam mo yun? And compared to other YouTubers and content creators, sila, they can film anything that they do. Ako, I have to do makeup for three hours, di ba? Imagine <laughs> the, the preparation I'm putting para lang makapag-vlog. Eh, kasi ganun yung content ko eh. So I talk to fellow artists kasi baka, you know, you may realize mo na you are not alone. You're not alone in this. I mean, uh, ba, dyan pa nga nanganganak yung, ano eh, yung mga collaboration. Uh, baka pwede natin itong gawin. Ano, this new normal. May mga nakikita ako sa Zoom meeting, naiging content na. For example, sabay-sabay sila naglalaro or they're talking about something. They're doing podcast. Diba? Now, us- hindi to usual na ginagawa nung dati. But in this better normal, Uy, gusto ko yung term nyo na ano, better normal. But in this better normal, <laughs> para mas positive, di ba? Na-explore na yung live streaming and podcast. You know? So, hindi lang ako, I'm not just talking about uh, content creation, but other other field of arts. Yeah. Talk to someone. Then next is, uh, you have to be, uh, do, not, do not be afraid to start again. Ayan. Um, or, nakalimutan ko lang ilagay, continue what you finish. Kasi baka mamaya, before the pandemic, meron kang nasimulan na hindi mo pa natapos kasi nga you, you felt stressed and confused and nagkaroon ka ng creative block. Eh once na dumadala na yung ideas na yun because you took a break, you welcome new ideas, di ba? And you put it in your journal, baka mamaya pwede mo nang simulan. Or simulan mo ulit. Kasi dati naman, just remember, ito, I love this quote by Jeffrey uh, Eugene, Eugenides. No one is waiting for you to write your first book. Kahit ibahin natin yan. For example, me. Wala naman nagiintay when I first uploaded my video. Eh. I don't have an audience. Nobody knows me. <laughs> diba? So no one cares if you finish it. But after, you fir- but after your first, if it goes well, everyone seems to be waiting. Diba? So wala namang masama. I mean, mas okay na nasubukan mo than you fail than not to try at all. Diba? Kasi yun, oh, ano yan eh? Like yung sinasabi, for example, traffic sa EDSA. Uh, pro- problem yun, tama. It's a problem. But kapag ka tumatagal, if it's not in your control, yung mga problema hindi mo na nasa, wala na sa kamay mo, hindi mo na siya makontrol, it becomes a way of life. And you just have to adjust to it. Just like with this pandemic, we just have to adjust to this. Alam mo, hindi naman natin pwedeng, alam mo yun, kung may superpowers ka lang sana to virus, gone. <laughs> diba? So, eh, diba? Pero hindi eh. We have to adjust. And we, it has to be the better normal. So, move forward. Just keep on moving forward. And I'm sure uh, one day may maaabot ka. And lastly, ay, di pa balas, uh, number six, uh, change your workspace. Ayan, number six. Next slide, please. Ito nakatulong to sa akin when I change my workspace. Kasi before... Um, I'm just working with a small room. Tapos nandun lahat. Uh, it's very noisy. It's very crowded. Uh, 
So I changed my workspace and fortunately, uh, magandang effect siya sa, ano yun, sa mindset mo as an artist. Ayan. Number six, please. Ayan. Next slide. <laughs> there you go. Ayan. Or simpler, just organize. Kung hindi ka naman makapag-change ng workspace, organize your stuff. It works. Ito medyo technical. Kasi, ano yan eh, magka-connect to sa number seven. Ayan. Next slide, please. Number seven is be productive with small tasks. Small accomplishments Ooh. attracts great accomplishments. Meron nagsabi, di ba, yung mga artists din or successful people, they encourage people to make their bed in the morning. <laughs> di ba, mag ka lang ako because that's a, a, an accomplishment already. Then, mga nganak yan. Mga nganak ng mga nganak yan. And I think, uh, isa yun sa pagtetrain mo sa, ano mo eh, sa mental, sa mental capacity mo to create things. You start with small stuff. Yun. And ano, hindi ko napapansin na ano dati, parang inisip ko, paano? Paano? Pero once you tried it, ideas will flow. Parang uh, you you are looking forward what's next to accomplish. So tapos ka na mag-make ng bed. Ano naman, magtimpla ka ng kape. Or next naman, maglinis ka ng banyo. Or next, ah, uupo na ako sa workspace ko. I'm going to create something. Kasi ang sarap sa feeling when you are accomplishing something, kahit maliit man. And it makes you feel good. And we are talking about creative block, which is a mental, it's a mental state. Yeah. yeah. So with that, yung, yung pagod mo, yung pagod ng mental health mo, um, ano eh, may ease down when you accomplish things eh. It will make you feel good na, ah, kaya ko pala, posible pala ako may matapos. So it starts from there. Be productive with small tasks. Kasi yung iba kaya na si stress, gusto agad nila yung malaki. Wala namang masamang mangarap sa malaki. But start with small task. Accomplish your small task first. And you go way up. Yan. Alright. So bonus lang. Ayan. Bonus. Ayan. Yun yung mga, ito, ito yung mga ano ko. Yun yung mga, na yun yung mga ginawa ko para ma-overcome yung creative block. And lahat yan sinalin ko through online content. Like what we are doing right now. Kasi wala na talagang ibang avenue eh. I mean, correct me if I'm wrong kung may iba pang avenue, pero online na talaga eh. <laughs> Di ba? Yeah. Yeah. Online. You do business seminars, online. You sell your products, online. You upload your videos, online. Everything is online. <laughs> Di ba? So, everything right now is an online content. Di ba? Mapa news, Mapa artworks, mapa live stream, kanina yung mga singers natin ang gagaling, di ba? Yeah, oh, so di ba? Ang, ang, uh, usually, ginagawa na nila ngayon, they are having online concerts. Online, yes. online, yes. online, online. <laughs> di ba? Yes. So, I just want to give this out kasi baka, baka it will be very helpful to you guys. I have thesis sa content creation. It's content consistency and connect. Isulat nyo sana to. Ayan. And number one is content, meaning wala yan sa gadget. Wala yan sa ganda ng microphone mo. Wala yan sa ganda ng camera mo. When I started my vlog, yung pinakauna kong nag-million views, we just used Samsung J7. Magkano lang yun? 2,000, 3,000 pesos? We don't have a microphone. I don't have uh, yung magarbong materials for prosthetics. Wala. I don't have a mamahaling wig. Wala. But I have a content. I know my content. My content is about horror and fandom and uh, geek culture. So I stick with my content and it works. Not because I have a magarbong gamit, but because I have a content. Next is consistency. Ito medyo ako guilty ako. Sometimes hindi ko siya masunod. Like, you know, my three-month break. Uh, consistency, when you say to your audience that you'll be uploading every week, you upload every week. If you say to your audience you'll be uploading every month, upload every month. Diba? Uh, consistency lang yan. Kasi once you stop, you will lose your audience. They will get confused. Kailan ba siya mag upload ng bago niyang panindang bag? Diba? Kailan kaya siya gagawa ng, ano? kailan kaya siya gagawa ng bagong character as a cosplayer? Kailan kaya siya mag -re release ng mga bago niyang photo shoots? O kaya, kailan kaya siya magre-release ng bago niyang podcast? Di ba? Pagka wala kang consistency, you will lose your audience. And next is number three, connect. Ito nakakalimutan naman ng iba. You have to connect to your audience. You have to 
create an engagement, you have to create a community. Ako, I have a Facebook group. It's called Prince de Guzman Fan Group. So I, I talk to them. Diba? What do you think about my new video? Ano mga suggestions nyo? Uh, meron din, kayo din ba gumagawa ng ganito? Let me know. So it's good to connect kasi it's, it will greatly affect your content, your online content. Kasi you have a community. Hindi ka lang nila pinapanood because they are entertained. But they are watching because, you know, they feel belong. They belong sila. And, and right now, lag, sinabi ko nga to dun sa post natin, sa, sa ano natin eh, sa group natin. Right now, we need a community, a strong community of artists. Kasi it's very challenging right now. Kahit hindi ka artist, for example, you're working in a corporate Ano lang, kailangan mo talaga ng support group kasi you will lose it kung wala kang kausap. So you have to connect. It will greatly affect you. Ayan. So sana nakatulong yan three C's na yan. If you are planning your next content, if you want to invite me, let's talk about content. Yan, pwede rin natin yan pag-usapan next time. <laughs> Ayan, okay. So final note. Ayan, meron tayong final note. Next on the next slide. Yeah, it's okay to not be okay. Yeah, familiar to sa mga K-drama fans. <laughs> Kasi may bagong, <laughs> uh, bagong K-drama sa Netflix, kaya ganyan yung title. But it's true. I love that. Actually, I love that series and I love the message. It's, it's okay to, to not be okay. And we do not need to submit to toxic positivity. Kasi ang dami ngayon, ah, okay lang yan. Kaya mo yan. Ano, Pagpe-pray na lang kita. Diba? Pero hindi. Eh. You have to acknowledge there is really a problem. Diba? There's something going on eh. So what you have to do is you have to acknowledge it and make a solution. Hindi yung okay lang yan. Diba? Wala naman masasolve yun eh. Let's be honest. So uh, we react on this pandemic differently. So yung iba nag-survive. Katulad ko, nag-three month break. Medyo na, medyo na shock ako. Yung iba talagang nahirapan. So that being said, these tips, yung mga sinabi kong tips may not work for everyone but one thing is for sure we can come up with a solution if we acknowledge the problem. Kasi, um, maaaring sa iba, they are very mentally healthy. Talagang they are very creative. Meron silang naisip. Katulad ng ano, may isa akong friend, uh, nagtayo siya ng Topsy business and it was very successful. Mabilis siyang nakapag, alam mo yun, nakakope up. Yung iba naman, medyo nahihirapan pa ngayon. But, unti-unti, they're finding a way. It's because they acknowledge the problem. They acknowledge kung saan sila magaling. And they acknowledge this better normal. It becomes their way of life. So it became successful. So kanya-kanya tayo ng ano, kanya-kanya tayo ng ano, reaction sa pandemic na to. So I don't, hindi ko ginadjudge yung iba. Hindi ko kayo sasabihan na tamad kayo or what. Pero uh, I'm sure babangon at babangon kayo if you will acknowledge the problem. Yan. Tulungan nyo yung sarili nyo. <laughs> Alright. And with that, yun, it's very fast. Sana malaman. And that's where I end my presentation. But if you have any questions, if yes, you want, let yes. me talk about something. Yeah, yeah. let's do it. Right. Thank, thank you, Sir Prince. It's actually, yeah, uh, ako rin, I'm a new parent when it comes to content creation because mm -hmm. I started my vlogs like two years ago, pero zero views uh, because yung, uh, I love doing uh, food vlogs and mm -hmm. then also travel. And then from there, uh, I, I thought about you know, because uh, you, uh, you mentioned a while ago that uh, you have to create more content. So from there, I, I, I tried, you know, making some review, movie reviews, trailer uh, movie reviews. I love that. So it's, I, I really learned a lot from you, sir. Please. Thank you so much. That's also, uh, yeah. also with our audience. Um, mm, so yeah. let's have uh, yeah. people here. So everyone, uh, the floor is now open for any questions to Sir Prince. Uh, so you're, you're doing vlogs, no? so right now, di ba, ano, medyo konti ang views. Yeah. I experienced that as well. Yeah. Siguro mga 10 videos before I get that boom. <laughs> so uh, ang, ang trick lang talaga is you just have to keep on creating because ako, I never expected. Actually, when I discovered that I have a million views, hindi ako yung nakadiscover. Someone said it to me. Yung, I think yung man, uh, ma a manager ko yata from ABS, they said, Oi, alam mo ba, nag 1 million ka na? What? I mean, what, what? <laughs> so, hindi ko alam. Uh, ang ano lang doon, uh, para lang din hindi ka ma-stress. And I think it will also create, uh, it will also affect creative block. Don't think yeah. about views and money muna. That's Ironically. Right. Yeah. I know, I, I, ako, I'm a very real person. Kaya ako nag-put up din ng vlog before. 
uh, baka opportunity to for additional earnings, di ba? Yeah. Pero ironically, uh, kahit, sinong, kahit sinong content creator, kahit siguro si Kong TV, masasabi ko sa'yo, uh, they started with just creating and not thinking about money or followers. But it will follow. <laughs> For sure. Kasi if you, if you don't enjoy what you're doing, talagang gigive up ka eh. Isa din yan sa post of creative block. You're forced to do something that you're not happy to do. So, yun. Iiwasan din natin yan. <laughs> And do we have uh, questions? Pwede ba ako magbasa? Yeah. Uh, let's see here. We have questions right now. Uh, pero when I greet sir, si David Ricardo, hello daw. Hello. And may isang Facebook user. <laughs> I don't know who this person is, but uh, this person is agreeing with you a while ago sa yung discussion. So, thank you so much, Mr. or Ms. Facebook thank user. You, <laughs> thank you so much. Pagdaan nila yung, ano, yung content, uh, consistency, yeah. and connect. And, uh, yeah. ano po, ang dami pala nagre-react. I just hit the comment section, actually. Yeah. Nice one. I but I can see their name right now. But thank you guys for watching. And I hope, uh, I'm encouraging you, yung mga nanonood, please support this uh, popcorn Better Normal And you can also donate via GCash and PayMaya. Ayan, if ina-flash nila sa screen nila ngayon. Uh, no, magpupunta, oh, ito, magpupunta naman ito sa maganda. Ayan. We have yes. to help one another right now. Ayan, I, ayan, I have a question. Sabi ni Chuck. Oh, see, ayan. yeah. Sabi, Chuck, what's your uh, question? Fire it away. Papi Carlo. Yeah. Fire it away. Ayan. Go ahead, Papi Carlo. Chuck, uh, Summers. Also, I know. I know. I know, yung three months na yun, it was very hard for me because mm. papagawa kami ng studio nung last mm. year pa. So imagine na delay siya for three months. Mm. So basically, naikitira ako sa house ng wife ko for three months din. So it was very hard kasi wala dun yung mga materials ko. Of course, it's a different environment. Though I'm very grateful and thankful. Siyempre, inalis yung way of life mo eh. Mm. All of a sudden. So... I became depressed. May mga time na hindi ka makatulog because you're thinking about, you know, how to survive this. May, may future yeah. pa ba? <laughs> diba? so But uh, with those, uh, with what I shared, yun yung ginamit ko para ma-overcome yung creative block. Yeah. And so far, so good. <laughs> yeah. Actually, sir, yeah. yung, uh, with, my, with my YouTube uh, channel now, uh, since nga, di maka-travel, di maka, you know, go eat some food right now, do some food reviews. As much possible, I order from some restaurants and then sa bahay na lang, I do food reviews. You can do it. But travel, no, you cannot do it. But food, yeah. You found a way. You found yeah. a way. So, doing yes. food reviews, eh, hindi ka makapunta sa mga restaurants. So, what should you do? Yeah. Order ka. So, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right now, uh, uh, share ko lang din, I'm producing something for my vlogging channel. It's called Craving Satisfied. So, ang oh, nice. aim is to is to showcase uh, online food businesses in the metro. Kasi, hindi ko pa patunayan na, di ba, we're vul vulnerable to our cravings right now, eh. Yes. Di ba? Kasi, <laughs> yeah. sabay, sabay, sabay ka lang. Guilty. Yeah. Oh, yung mga nanonood, <laughs> guilty, guilty. <laughs> guilty. Pagawarma. <laughs> <laughs> Gusto ko ng ice cream, di ba? So, yeah. papatunayan ko sa vlog na yun na, you can, you can, uh, you can satisfy your cravings with just staying at home. With what? You order. Diba? Explore. Kasi with that din, naka, na, na craving satisfied ka na, nakatulong ka pa sa mga online business sellers. Diba? Yes. yes. Sure. Yeah. Became a way of life. Diba? Yeah, yeah. A win-win <laughs> situation for this restaurant. Si kasi you you order from them and then you review their food and at the same time you promote it. Because it's just mm -hmm. diba? uh, best uh, strategy to get uh, more customers right now. And then, then uh, nagamit ko din yan because I talk to them. Like, what, what's mm -hmm. up? you have there, di ba? Yeah. And sabi ko, sige, let's do, let's try to do something. It might work out, it might not, but it will help each other din. Kasi ako, content-wise, may content ako. Ikaw naman, mm -hmm. na promote ko yung food mo. May potential buyer, so. Yeah. Yung mga ganun bang idea. Sana, yung mga nanonood, sana mapanood to ng mga crafters or yeah. cosplayers or yung mga katulad mo, nagre-review ng toys or food or Uh, yeah. Nagka-travel vlog dati, it's yeah. not, uh, marami pang pwede. Hindi, na to, hindi to period. It's Tama. a comma. Yeah. <laughs> it's a comma lang. In, in your YouTube channel, you can, 
uh, add new content eh, ka nga, diba? You have to create new content, you know, diba? So, That's don't right. stop your creativity. There we go. Agree. Uh, Mm-hmm. Right. May nag-comment so, dito, uh, we love Prince. <laughs> Salamat oh. naman. <laughs> Ayan, all that. My wife is also a content creator. Siya naman oh. is, uh, ano din, na-experience niya din to. Actually, pareho kami. Actually, kasabot pa siya bumili ng Nintendo Switch. <laughs> so, yun. Yun din. Uh, uh, siya naman cosplayer. Pero okay. right now, what we do is, we vlog, uh, we vlog our toys. And oh, we nice. vlog uh, something that we can create here at home. So and then that's how we survive then. Yung creative block. Actually, yung creative block hindi siya biro ah. First time ko siya na experience and grabe halos squeeze mo yung brain mo eh. But nothing's mm-hmm. coming up. <laughs> okay. May yeah. question. Yeah. If you guys have questions, uh, leave it. I think we still have time but you know, you called it not PJ if you have questions. Yeah, uh, I have questions. Actually, this is, uh, I don't know, it's my question to previous final ko na hindi ko natanong. But, All right. Uh, here we go. Uh, what is your, uh, well, who is your favorite YouTuber or content creator and why? Locally or in abroad? Ako locally talaga si Kong. Mm. Kong TV. Uh, just because of his content. But but meron siyang power to uplift other content creators, which is I really admire to him. Because he was able to create yung team payaman. Mm, yeah. I always I always share this din sa alam mo yun, sa mga friends ko. Uh, have uh, being able to create a solid support team who yeah. are also passionate like you mm. is something. Eh. Uh, it's it's power. <laughs> so you should like power. Yeah. Not just oh, shut up. You oh nga, no? tagline niya pala yun, uh, power. Power, power yeah. yeah. Uh, ano na yun eh? It's beyond the content na eh. It's beyond the videos. Uh, he was able to help dreams come true. Hmm. Diba? And siya talaga yung pinaka hinahangaan ko. And I yun yung ina-encourage ko din sa mga kahit pa paano may audiences na rin na uh, YouTubers na uh, uplift one another, do collabs. Kasi, uh, ano din yan eh, technically, for, uh, yung market, yung audiences, di ba yung mga artista nag youtube na rin? <laughs> yung mga audiences din na pumunta din sa YouTube. So, it's yeah. it's a wider audience din. And may question, what's your plan? <laughs> After uh, 1 million subscribers, yeah. From Hey Chuck. Chuck Pablo, ayan, may channel din yan si Hey Chuck. Yata yun, yung channel niya. My plan yeah. is to eat a lot of cake. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. My plan is to keep going. Kasi 1 million, I think, pag nakaabot na ako doon, it's a solid, ano na eh, solid audience na. And I'm confident yeah. naman na one day, maybe before the year ends, mag 1M subs tayo. And first thing yeah. I'll do is to, I always say this, I thank my team, you know, my costume creators, ayan, my uh si Awi, yung wife ko kasi talaga sila yung makatulo. This is not a one man team anymore. If you're mm-hmm. growing, you yeah. then I just want to add that. For example, nag start ka ng content, medyo nag boom, you really need to absorb people kasi it will become uh, very helpful for you. One is uh productive ka kasi makakapag-pursue ka ng maraming bagay kasi nga marami kayo. Two heads are better than one eh. So yeah. right now ko, oh, katulad ko, may I edit my videos, I film my videos, pero meron na ako ngayon uh, photographer. Meron na ako ngayon sometimes. Sometimes na naman si Awi nag-e-edit. So we help, we help one another and it affects uh, our workflow positively. Mm-hmm. Okay. Great. Ako, um, when I saw so sila Kong, you know, I was really inspired by them. Uh, you know, they have a unique bond, you know, friendship, you know, and they support each other. Uh, mm. Which also reminds me, one of my favorite YouTubers is an alive, see, uh, Mr. Beast. Mr. No, Beast. Mr. Yeah, Mr. Beast is very nice guy. He's very, you know, he really helps a lot. Diba? Sabi nga, I hate money, so I want to, you know, share, share, share yeah. my... Yeah, binibigay yan, diba? You know, with his mm. friends, with his cast, diba, sa crew niya. And to That's strangers, right. uh, he, he, mm. a lot, he helped a lot of strangers uh, with his channel. Uh, and so, you know, yeah. ano... Uh, Kaya din yan hindi nauubusan. Kaya hindi sila naka-experience din ng creative block. Kasi they love what they're doing. Yes. <laughs> so, oh, actually, yeah. 
siya. Si Lakong. Uh, Lakong gusto nila yan eh. I mean, they would That's just right. wake up in the morning and film. Gusto ko to gawin. Then yeah, upload yeah. it on YouTube. Upload it, yeah. Do something Parang, that will really make you happy. That's true, yeah. Like, that's, <laughs> like I have a challenge for you guys. Right, so, who is? <laughs> that's okay, it. Mr. Yeah, Mr. I like sana, Mr. Beast. Sana all Mr. Beast. Oh, ha, sana Mr. Beast. Sana sa pilipin si Mr. Beast, di ba? Right, <laughs> sabi right. Ni, sabi ni Facebook user, yeah, Mr. Beast is generally, generously, yes, he is very generously insane. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's But, right. Ma, and so, I think uh, itong popcorn better normal, it's the, is, is it the first of its, of, of its kind? Yes. Parang wala pa akong nakikita. Right? This is the first. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the first, first ever. Time, yeah. So thank you so much for doing this. You're Kasi welcome. Ito, uh, I'm sure first time nyo to, but I think you're doing it well. So susunod, yeah. Diba? Yeah. You yeah. learn from this, then next time, <laughs> do yeah. something new. <laughs> And so, ako, dito, you know, susunod, dito na tayo gagawa ng stage for cosplayers. Dito na sila rarampa online. Oh, <laughs> ano, yeah. Actually, later, uh, tonight after this, we have a, uh, don't forget po, uh, it's a flexor quarantine cosplay. So later on, we'll see uh, the best cosplayers in the Philippines. Wow. I think 20, 20 of them will be here. So we have the prince. Who... Wish I can join, Kaso. Kung jo join na kada pan ni, alam na may makeup na. Ako. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. Next, oh, time. next time, next time. Yeah. You can help, you know. Uh, you can stick around uh, this event. So to check out the top cosplayers. So yeah, I think that's about it. Uh, yep. Yeah, I've learned a lot. Thank you again, Sir Prince. You know, Thank you. Hopefully, yeah, hopefully we'll see you again. And also, guys, uh, yeah. if you have something to share or some or question yeah. about Creative Block, you can ask them later. You can yes. uh, you can PM my Facebook page, Prince Degusto Transformations. Uh, it has a blue check, naman, so you, you're yeah. going to see it. I also have an Instagram, and of course, I have my YouTube channel, Prince Degusto yeah. Transformations. Thank you so much, Popcorn Better Normal. Mabuhay kayo. Thank you so much for doing this. Yes, my boy, my girl. Oh my god! Oh, 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 my guest, Nigla. My guest, no. Who is that? Ay, bali ba ala ko? Hindi ala pa ala ko. Sino ba yan? Master Pogi. Master Pogi. Ay, edit yung pa ala ko. Hindi ako yan. Sino yan? Sino yan? Sino talaga mga nagpapal po ng event na to? Mga wala mga nagpapal. Yeah, 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 yeah. Tama, ang organizer na ito, mga walang kwenta, hindi marunong. Mali-mali yung pangalan ko. Yes, magandang uh, gabi na sa'yo, Prince. Yes. Magandang gabi po, Master Pogi. Magandang gabi naman sa'yo. Pogi ka rin, pero mas Pogi ako. Oo oh, naman. <laughs> Share ko lang ito, ha. Uh, yung last last convention ko nung 20, 2009, 2012, si Master Pogi yung nanalo nun. Doon pa lang hindi ko makalimutan. Grabe yung fans. Buwat-buwat siya. Tapos lahat subisigaw na Pogi, Pogi. Bago pa sinisigaw yung power ni Kong, una yan, Pogi, Pogi. Alam, alam, alam nyo, yung, yung nangyari nun, may kwento ako doon na konti. Noong 2012, kalilipat ko lang yung mga anak ko, nine years kong hindi nakasama. So oh. noong 2012, uh, nakasama ko sila uli after nine years. Tapos nung toy ko na yun, uh, wala kaming pera. Alam mo ba yon As in talagang kinabukasan dapat, wala na kayong makakain, lalayas kami sa bahay, totoo mo itong storya to ha. Then, nag, yung skit ng Master Pogi na yon, pinag-isipan ko a day before. As in walang plan, sabi ko, bahala na, kailangan ko manalo kung ano man. Kasi talaga nagkasakit ako nun eh. So, so nag-skit ako, nanalo ako, yun. Nagsimula na ano, naging okay ang lahat. So salamat I'm so, talaga sa I'm so honored to witness that moment. Talagang grabe, di ko makalimutan. Hindi nalang alam. Talagang ano yun, gipit na panahon yun. Kaya nga tuwan-tuwa ako, umiyak ako nung manalo ako doon. That's when I Ito, realized na, alam mo yun, sa mga ganyang competition, kahit sa content, hindi kailangan sobrang grabe. No? I don't know, no offense sa mga ano, pero grabe talaga siya doon, yung, yung fan base niya iba. Talagang wild. <laughs> Lahat sumisigaw ng pogi. <laughs> Kamado nga ako doon, kasi yung nasa unahan ko, Lady Gundam. Ang laki-laki ng costume na. Diyos ko, sabi ko, manalalo ba ako? Pareho pa naman kami ng category, anime. Sabi ko, ano po? Wow, eh, na-witness ko yun. I'm so proud. I'm so proud. The same story nung nanalo rin ako sa toy. Kaya nga naniniwala ko sa pinasa, sinasabi mo. 
kailangan ka may consistency lalo sa karakter mo, nagta-transform ka, di ba? Yung sa towing, hindi ko rin inaasahan yun kasi kalaban ko si na Thomas, si na Nibel, ang gagaling ng skip nila. Tapos ang ginawa ko lang, pinagalitan ko yung ano, yung may-ari ng towing sa kayo nagdo-throwing. Sabi ko, bakit wala akong pelikula? At siyempre, pinagalitan ko yung hapon, walang pelikula si Master Pope. Ganun lang lang mo. Ganun lang lang mo. Kasi ko lang, mga walang hiya yung ano na yan, towing na yan, nagsara na. Hanggang ngayon. <laughs> Grabe so solo na, film eh no. Ito talaga Master Pogi. I would love to to meet you again after this better normal. Bata ka pa noon eh. Ah, kabit bit 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 ka na nanay mo. A joke lang. <laughs> Pero agree oh, grabe. Totoy na totoy. <laughs> toto. <laughs> Ilang taon ka ba noon 2000? Very friends of me. 12 years old. Oh, wow. 2012. na maraming following doon magsisimula yung yung pagboom ng ano ng YouTube Tama. channel mo kasi Tama. hindi ako pala PM kasi Tama. nahihiya ako na alam mo yun yung pa-subscribe mag subscribe ka kung gusto mo ano, alam mo yun kasi hindi ako eh tapos minsan sa Facebook ako okay share mo lang yan after pogi maggo-grow yan ikaw pa grabe yung ano na pati pa mo twin channel ko pogi show yan Uh, o, oh, may tawag ka na agad sa mga fanbase mo. Ayun o, Pogi. <laughs> oh, kamusta naman kayo lahat dyan? Tawag kayo ng tawag. Akong Pogi dito. Huwag kayong umepal. Sabi na, Pogi. Thank you. I love you. <laughs> Christian, oh, Duncan Pogi. James, Chuck Summers. Ayun, inagaw ko na yung ano mo, yung session mo. Ako na nagpapasession dito. Tinuro ako kasi ng Pogi. Isa session nyo, ha? <laughs> Tinuro ko ta- lang yan. <laughs> So, salamat sa pag-attend. Maraming salamat sa iyo. Maraming salamat po. Thank you. Maraming Master Pogi at PJ, thank you very much. And I hope to, to collaborate with you again. Yeah. Yes. One PM away. <laughs> yeah. Sa mga gusto mo magtanong, i-comment nyo lang dito. I-sesend namin lahat yung tanong nyo kay Prince. At bahala yeah. siyang sumagot. Mahilo um, siya kakasagot. <laughs> Maraming salamat to our audience. Thank you. Support. Support this campaign please yeah yes thank you so much pwede thank pa you. kayo mag donate yan donate lang po kayo pupunta sa pista ko ah hindi joke lang hindi po medyo ilo-audit tayo kaya hindi hindi yung pangalan ninyo di ba pangalan email okay. sa kayo iba pang bagay kasi kailangan i-document yan thank you so, for environment o kayo na muna ng dalawa alis na ako ha goodbye Uh, so Salamat, lang po. Salamat, Salamat sa ating special guest for tonight, si Master yeah. Pogi. Oh my gosh, unexpected. Ah, yeah. So, <laughs> Wait, uh, yeah. Thank you, PJ. Thank you. Hey, thank you. Uh, it's my honor, sir. Honor. Finally, I, I met uh, the man behind uh, Pennywise, Pinhead, uh, oh, Peace, Shazam. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It's an honor, thank sir. you. So, yeah, thank yeah, let's do it. Yeah. Hopefully, I will guest uh, you. Be my guest in my live stream. Uh, JS is just live. Let's do it. Yeah. Yes. Thank Looking you, yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much din po sa mga, man- na mga nanood. Sana meron yes. kayo natutupan. Thank you, Keep mga safe. audience. Yeah. Keep safe. Stay at home. Yeah. Yes. Stay safe. Stay safe. And uh, physical distancing. Kahit sa bahay. Hindi joke lang. Yeah. <laughs> But, uh, yeah. But again, if you want to, again, uh, follow uh, Sir Prince's uh, social media so yeah it's prince de guzman transformations right in in uh, youtube and in it's facebook cool. facebook yeah so very much yeah so all social media wala sir wala twitter yeah, no twitter sir wala wala man yeah, wala no twitter uh, wala twitter <laughs> no twitter but Thank hopefully you. yeah you will consider game streaming then with your switch soon so, ah yeah, yeah. sige tignan natin yan yeah. <laughs> yeah 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 all right so again thank you again sir prince de guzman for your time tonight or today here in uh, Popcorn Villa Normal. So, okay guys, some of you were on tight guys. A few minutes along, we'll be seeing the best cosplayers in the Philippines with Flexer Quarantine 
cosplay right there. And um, again, please help. Uh, please donate. Uh, you know, uh, right now for cause. Uh, all funds will be uh, donated to Greenpeace po and uh, to Action Kalitas. So this is for the good of our environment. Okay. So again, thanks so much for watching. Uh, again, keep safe, stay safe. See you soon. Sir Prince, ingat po. Thank you again. And yep, that's all for now for me. This is Chat. This is Chat. This is for you. Uh, Pija Zena. Have a good evening, guys. Ingat. Bye now. Bye. 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 My name is Sushmita. I'm Sam. Broadcasting live from Global TV Bollywood Studio, India. Live from Global TV London Studio. You are watching Global TV Philippines. I'm so excited to join you. Catch me soon on the Rapporteur News with, with Isabel, Isabel Fernandez, Fernandez and, and Chino, Chino Hansel Filia. Together, let's unite the universe with substance by bringing news you can trust. Until then. See you. Oh, <laughs> my